If you have a long form, then you may want to divide it into sections based on the information that you uh, uh, choose to get from the users. So let's say I'm, I'm, going, I'm going to go around and click on the add section button right here. And that is how you add the section. We can also click and drag around and move around the question onto other section right here. So let me just go around, keep it under this section right here. So the second section right here is going to be personal information right here. So let's say I want to ask things like name right here. So let me just go around and select short answer for this. Click on plus button and let me just go around and say uh, gender. And this is going to be male or female right here, just like this. Mm, let me just go around and I did male or female. And I'm just going to add in others as well because that is an option as well. And I'm going to go around over here and click on add question. And over here, uh, let's say uh, I'm going to add an address right here. And this is going to be a paragraph right here, just like this. So this is the second section. And let's say the other section is regarding the opinion. So I'm going to go around, click on the uh, add section button right here and another section has been added out. So over here what I can do is I can go around and say uh, this is going to be opinion. So opinion right here. So once I do that I can go around press the plus button to add in question and I'm going to go around and add in let's say for example multiple choice. Uh, so I'm going to add in one option as yes and another option as no right here. And the question that I'm going to ask is uh, let's say for example do you agree uh, that Google Forms is a powerful tool, just like this. So I can go around and ask a question right here. This is going to be opinion right here. I can add in another section over here as well. And let's say this section is going to be contact details right here. So I'm going to go around and then add in a question over here. And let me just go around and add in a short answer. And I'm going to say phone number just like this. And I'm going to add in another and this is going to be email address just like this. And then this is going to be a short answer over here. So I can see that I have divided everything into sections. And if I were to go around onto the preview, you'll be able to see that it, this is the form. You can click next and then it goes to the first section. Click next again. It goes on to this second section next and next. And you can see that. Uh, it says response has been recorded. So what people can do is they can click next. They can go around and add in name over here. So let me just add in tutor tubes. They can select out the gender. They can add in addresses and hit next. And I'm going to say yes and click next right here. And they can add in the phone number and they can add in email address as well. Just like this and click submit and the information will be recorded as you can see right here. And that is how you can divide the forms into section, especially when you have a lot of information so that um, uh, managing uh, and entering the information becomes easy. So I hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.